everyone how you doing good morning good morning 10 a.m stream the usual weekday 10 a.m stream um today gran turismo now um as you know i've been playing gran turismo um since the demo come out um and i've been playing it on my um racing rigs so i've got a gt amiga um steering wheel stand with the seat um logitech g29 with the pedals um with a screen in front of me it's like playing an arcade machine it's awesome you know you're sitting in there you can feel everything you can feel the sense of speed because you're sitting in that position um you're um you're on the you're on the steering wheel it, it's as real as you can possibly get um what i haven't tried is this little bad boy um the dualshock 4 now all the other gran turismos all of them i used to play with a controller um and it wasn't until i've had a i've had a bit of a hiatus um from racing games for about probably about five years really literally i've, I've just not played any racing games uh and my wife brought me the g29 about 18 months ago um and then i thought oh okay i'll get into it and no no racing game was just tempting me project cars one didn't really do it so i've started um playing racing games again i've got project cars 2 um which i love Oh my god, I played it the other night in, <laughs> I'm still stunned by it, in VR. Oh my god, the, the Ferrari 488, it's just, oh my god, it's just beautiful. I don't think I've ever had um, so much fun sitting in my racing seat with the VR on, racing, just pounding it through the corners. I absolutely loved it. It was just, it was just insane. Um, but I haven't, um, so yeah, I'm back on racing, but I haven't tried this. Now, you know, when I, when I play, I'm talking about the game. And it's almost like you're assuming that everyone's got a steering wheel. And of course they haven't, you know, not everyone even wants a steering wheel. Not everyone's got room for a steering wheel. So what does the Gran Turismo demo play like with this? Now, so I'm not a noob with a controller. It's not going to be like um, Elite Dangerous, right? I'm all right with this. The thing that I am going to do, though, is put it on automatic gears because it's been that long. And I'm going to let you into a little secret, right? When I used to play Gran Turismo 1 and 2, I always used to do automatic gears, right? What a girl. What a girl. Not that girls can't do manual, you know? But what a girl. So rather than trying to stumble through the controller and, you know, oh god, oh yeah, you know, you know what I mean? I'm just going to leave it as I used to play it um, and see what, see what it's like. So I can just concentrate on the feeling that the game's given me of control through the controller without worrying about changing gears right? I'm just gonna do automatic gears how do you unsubscribe <laughs> love it demon love it right let me say hello no this is <laughs> this is just about what does this game feel like with the controller not how good I am not how fast I am it's just about that so I want to keep it I want to keep it on that playing field you know I'm going to say hello to you lovely early birds, 25 of you in straight away, beautiful people. Let me say hello, get them doors ready because the early birds are about to close, right? I'm a little bit early today, I'm bang on time, aren't I? Look at that, with a short um, intermission screen. Who was first today? Chris was first. Hello Chris, how you doing? Hello Stuart, how are you? And of course the lovely demon, of course he's here isn't he? And Mark Wall, how are you mate? And Miklos, who's a lovely sponsor, thanks for being a sponsor mate. Uh, we've got Robocod. How you doing, mate? Still love your name, Robocod. It still cracks me up. Virtual Reality Gremlin. How are you, mate? Stretchmaster P. How are you? Uh, Robocod is saying uh, Gran Turismo is causing him some decision grief. I'm torn because it's almost too arcade for me, but it's been quite fun at the same time. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. What? What is that? Let me close... Let me close that. I don't know what that is. An error of some sort. Let me close Outlook. <laughs> Outlook's running in the background. It's not a business. It's a. It's an arcade, all right? <laughs> uh, and uh, Robocod had some trouble with it, apparently. Uh, the servers do keep going down, but I think they're, they're, they're calling it a demo, but they're actually using this more of a, a beta, aren't they? They're testing the servers. That's what they're doing. Hello, Commander Wu, another sponsor. Thank you very much, mate. How are you? And Eric Vander Hyde. How you doing, mate? How you doing? Oh my god, he's early. I know. Tweet Chris, how you doing, Tweet? And Schwing, uh, a lovely sponsor. And Codus, who's a lovely sponsor as well. Thank you very much. Absolutely awesome. Why hasn't... Um, 
Why hasn't Codus's name come up in green? Probably because he's a mod as well, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, okay. That's what put me off there. Sorry, Codus. I didn't see you there for a minute. Um, must have pooed the bed. I did not poo the bed. I haven't done that in weeks, all right? <laughs> I haven't done it in weeks. I'll get it if Jason is definitely setting up a proper group. Because race. It. Yeah, I'll be setting up a group, of course. Dark, Lu Dark Lord Spooky, how are you doing? I'm very keen to hear your controller thoughts. Oh, you will hear them. You will hear them tweet. And Jay Oa, how are you doing, Roger? And Steve Ross, hello, Steve. I have rules for both consoles, but never use them due to the faff of getting them out and putting them away. Yes, tweet. Yeah, that is that's another thing. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, how do you unsubscribe? Anyone have any info? Um, oh God, where are you gone? About an affordable wheel for the PlayStation 4. Last time I checked, they were all 200. What about um, a Frostmaster T1? Is it a 130, which is their entry one, or a 150? Scarab, another sponsor. Thank you very much. Oi, oi, how are you? Did you shit the bed? No, I told you, I haven't done that in weeks. More than BBC, anyway. Yeah, I know, Demon. Right, we're getting to the bottom. Hello, Oddball, how you doing? There's a lot of early birds today, I tell you. Hello, Turho, how you doing? And with now, another sponsor. Thank you very much. Love you all. That's it. T oh, T80 is entry. Oh, well, how much is the T80 then, Shwing? Shut the doors. That's it. That's early birds. No one else can get in. Right, that's it. Right. Hurry up. I've got to post a visit bank soon. <laughs> I'm happy with it. Oh, 70 quid. 70 quid. That's cheap, isn't it? That's lovely, that is. Right, we're playing with this, right? So let's get in here. Let's get straight into an arcade race. Okay. So, uh... Oh, T80 has no false feedback. You need it. You need false feedback. You do. I like this track so far. I like Dragon Tower, uh, Dragon Trail Seaside. I really, really like it. That is actually my favourite track so far. <clears throat> Why they've omitted proper night time? Why they've omitted rain annoys me. Why they've omitted VR annoys me. But I still like this game. I still like it. I really do like it. Actually, I'm I'm 100% buying it. Oh, I do like the Lexus as well. Yeah, you need full speed feedback, yeah. Hello, McKay, how you doing? Sit up, room, and I will join you. Yeah, no worries, Shrink. Let me just do a quick arcade. I'm going automatic because I'm just judging this as um, a way to um, play the game, right? Early birds. So, oh, all right. Sp open the door. Spider's coming. Come on, get in here, spider. Get in here. <laughs> yes, I don't think they're doing dynamic weather, and I hope they've... Um, what is it, like noon over there? It's 10 o'clock in the morning, mate. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. Back on racing. There's going to be loads of racing, McKay. Yes, yeah, massive, um, massive feature racing's going to be. Grump, grumpy, thank you very much. Get myself, a, uh, let me uh, let me read that message. That's important. Got myself a will. I'm blown away. Thanks for re my enthusiasm. Thank you very much, grumpy. That's absolutely awesome, mate. Love to hear that. Love to hear it. No, I'm definitely, there's going to be loads of racing. Racing is a massive feature now on the channel, there's just no doubt about it. And I'll tell you what, oh my god, the other night when I played Project Cars 2 in VR, um, what do you mean exactly by dynamic rever? Well, starting the race like this, and then it clouds over, then you get a bit of spitting, then as you maybe go up into the mountain, it pours hard, <laughs> a bit of snow on the way down. Yeah, but just changing weather, just changing weather. I think I had, um, like I talk about... Um, gaming moments than I a lot and I think I had um, I think my gaming moment peaked the other night in VR absolutely smashing that Ferrari 488 ran the Nürburgring GP it, it was up it was unbelievable I couldn't believe how much I was enjoying like I was thinking to myself I'm just in, you know when you think about something I am just enjoying this so much the VR was amazing the car itself felt the most real I've ever sat in a car I could control it right I could smash it actually I was doing I was doing pretty good right I'm gonna say it myself I was doing pretty good it was unbelievable and and I've got that just sitting there you know we I tell you what as gamers we are so lucky you might have to pay a bit of moolah right but if you are willing to pay like I don't go down the pub I don't I really go out I'm a, I'm a homeboy you know so I don't I don't waste money going out that's that's my hobby so if we're lucky enough that if you can afford it or want to afford it more importantly my god the fun you can have on a computer game these days is literally oh it's mental too bad those won't work on ps4 very easily it can be done with tweaking all right okay 
you improve when you found the better cam view. No, this, yeah, yes, yes, woo, but I'm talking about in VR. In VR, I'm inside the car, that's fine. Right, let's have, a, let's try the controller. I haven't even tried it. <clears throat> let's see whether I can, uh, I can race fairly good with this. Now, this, this, as you know, is, oh. This, as you know, is my view now. I'm not messing around with the inside view. <clears throat> and then we do some online races. I love the sound of this, um, this Lexus. Ooh, nicely slipped in there. Ooh. Right, give me a give me a race to get used to it. Oh, it is. Lo I love Gran Turismo. I've got no problem with it. It's the more I play it, the more I can be opinionated about it. But yeah, I'm definitely buying it. It's fantastic. It is an awesome little racing game. The sound is really good, really good actually. The engine sound. I still don't think you'll beat that 488 Ferrari sound in Project Cars 2 though. Oh my god, the turbo whine was just... Uh, it was just too much for me at times. It was just too much. Oh, I feel like I'm back with the controller. There's nothing wrong with the controller, I tell you. Nothing wrong... Oh, nothing wrong with it at all. <clears throat> See what I mean? I'm alright at racing, you know, it's just that I had such a such a hiatus from it and uh, just left it for years, and I mean the years, probably. Hello Dead Man Rising, another sponsor, thank you very much mate, how are you? I left it for, I left racing for about four or five years, you know, not touched it, you know, but I always, that used to be, oh fuck, that used to be my genre, you know, racing, and now I'm slowly getting back into it. Any chance you can race in the Lambo? Of course. This is the last few hours of the demo now, so as soon as it finishes, I'm going to head straight to the pre-order page. It's alright of a controller though, I'll tell you what, it's, it is, it is, it's fun. Yeah, it, it's cool. I was wondering what mine, and, right, this is what I'm going to get opinionated about, Gran Turismo. The collision mechanic is absolutely shit. It is, it's unbelievable, it's just rubbish. It's pure arcade. Absolutely pure arcade, I don't know what they was thinking. It's straight out of Gran Turismo 1, <laughs> and I mean straight out of it, it's crazy. Uh, but it's not stopping me enjoying it, which is really weird. Especially as there's other options available. I mean, if I hated it that much, I could just project, put Project Cars 2 on, which has got damage, but it's not stopping me play the, playing the game. i tell you what. Oh, there's my car, look. I've actually got an RCZ in real life. Look, look at this art. Look, look at this mechanic, look. I'm, <laughs> just, I'm, I'm nudging it. I'm nudging it. It's ridiculous. It's really bad, actually. The more you play it, the more you realise the bump bumping mechanic is <laughs> it's diabolical. It really is. It plays really well with a controller. I mean, look, you know? Yes, tweet. But it shouldn't be, should it? This, they've been working on the... The last time we had a Gran Turismo game was 2013, you know? It's now 2017. It, the, the, the collision box shouldn't be that bad, should it? Yes, yeah, so, I mean, I, I kept saying, um, I'm sorry about being wobbly, this is my first time on a controller in literally years, but it's alright, I'm doing alright, it, it shows you how, you know, how, um, how cool the controller is, I, I can do it, you know, I can do it. I keep placing this, um, I've had a bit of a re-evaluation, I keep saying that Forza is the most arcade, I think, I think Gran Turismo is the most arcade. At least you can you can fiddle with Forza more and make it into a sim. I mean, they have got that market. They have got sim races on Forza. You can do a few bits to this, um, but I think I think this is actually probably the most. This is a this is almost a pure arcade racer, isn't it? But like I say, it doesn't stop me loving the game. I, I like I like it. I'm going to buy it. You know. <clears throat> <laughs> Dead man, uh, sorry, Oddball is uh, watching watching this and playing on Elite. Awesome. 
I had a bit of a leak yesterday, but the servers went down. <laughs> that was nice of them, wasn't it? Literally, as I was about to land as well. Tire squeal is only excessive on standard tyres, though. Yeah, but even if it is excessive, it sounds ridiculous. You know, it just sounds ridiculous. Um, yeah, it is great for a fresh, and I think it would be good with friends. Like you said up earlier on in the chat, um, I think if we are going to have a community race, this is the game to do it on. You know, I think this is the game to do it on. And I love all this. I know this is only a real picture where you've placed your car, but, it, you know, the presentation. Um, yes, this history stuff is a bit... Yeah, it should be history of cars, shouldn't it? Why Skype in here? What about... There's enough, there's enough interest in the history of cars just to include car history, you know? Hello, Khan. Oh, out of 10. That's a difficult one. That's a difficult one. Let me think. I reckon... I reckon it's... Hmm. It's a seven. It's a seven, isn't it? Seven, maybe eight, you know? What is with all that Windows 10 stuff? Exactly. Demo room. Yeah. Seven or eight. Let's say eight. Yeah, let's push it up to an eight to match Demon. Let's, let's say eight. But then that means that something like Project Cars has got to be a ten, because I do think I prefer Project Cars, and Project Cars isn't a ten. Might be in VR, but not in 2D. Um, I think, no, I think seven. I think seven. Seven's a good score anyway. Seven out of ten um, is a good score. Right, let's do an online race. Come and join me. Come and join me, Schwing. Let's go. Oh, with Nurbo GP. Love that. Got it that I can't uh, pit my Civic. Uh, yeah, yeah. Always the juice. Thank you, Khan. Thanks, mate. Right, let's. Someone wanted a Lambo. Wu wanted a Lambo. So we're going to go Hurricane. That's going to hurt. I do like this daily race thing. I like it. I think it's awesome. Uh, I, I really do. Hello, Tanks. How you doing? Yeah, I really do like the daily race thing. And I like the way they're including new tracks in the demo. I like I like that. I like that. Because they haven't had Nurburg Ring GP. Now, you know that's one of my favourite tracks. And you know I was playing that the other day. So this is going to be a nice... Um, this is going to be a nice test of Nurburg Ring GP. There's going to be lots of FIFA. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think they should bring more cars in? What, more than 170? No, no, not really. No, I'm quite happy with 170. Is it 170? It's 170 cars. That's enough for anyone, isn't it? Come on, you know? That's my opinion, anyway. I'd rather them go back and touch the trees up. And my... But this is going to be a good test, right? This is going to be a good test, because I know and like this track. I know and like it. <laughs> no Citroen. Yeah, exactly. Let's just get, let's get nice and prepped up. Hello, Andy. No, it finishes in a couple of hours, mate. Either that or they've just let me on because I'm just so fucking special, you know what I mean? <laughs> I don't mean special, I mean special. Where's the 918? Is there? Is it not in there, Khan? Maybe they haven't got the license yet. Sorry, I haven't got the braking on this Lambo yet. I've literally just gone into it. <laughs> yeah, thank you, John. I'll tell you what, though. With a controller, you're not missing out. If you if you don't want to pay for a steering wheel, or you just don't want one, it's, you know, not everyone wants a steering wheel. Not everyone's got room for one. Um, I'm lucky enough that I've got a little gaming room here, so my rig's all set up there. You're not missing out. I suppose you are missing out of a controller. It's always going to be better with a wheel, isn't it? But you're not, you're not totally missing out, you know? What you are missing out on is a bit of finesse, because you can't keep the steering... There's a lot of correction, isn't there? And on a replay, you would see that. And I think you would know when you're racing someone with a steering wheel. You would just know, because you got... Um, or a controller, because... Uh, you just know, don't you? The wheels are permanently flicking left and right to correct it. Whereas, obviously, with a steering wheel, that doesn't really happen, you know? But I wouldn't lose any sleep. If you haven't got a controller, if you haven't got a steering wheel, um, I wouldn't lose any sleep. This this game is, especially this game, This it almost feels like this game totally suits a controller. Because it is arcade, you know, it is an arcade racer. And I do love this track. I don't know why this is one of my favourite tracks. I think it's because... Uh, it's just got a bit of everything in it, you know, you've got fast, I love, I love sweeping bends that you can power through, full power, like this one for example, is, is a full power corner, I love that. 
hard braking sections, lefts and rights. I mean, this this track really has genuinely got it all. It's nice graphics, though, isn't it? It, it has got lovely, lovely graphics. I'm still uh, cockpit view. I can do, but. I don't like it. Which one is the? Which one is it? Oh God, it's that one. I don't like it. I've decided not to do cockpit view, but I will do it for you, though. I just can't see enough of what's going on. It it hampers the vision too much, and it might look cool, but all of a sudden you've gone from a full screen full screen, especially when you start racing up against the rest of the pack, massive car models to everything shrunk down to a tiny little screen based around this, this car overlay and the only thing that moves is the steering wheel it's just, I don't know I prefer that, I do genuinely prefer that look at how big the car model is now, look how much more track you're seeing I think what it is, that inside view, it almost makes me feel like I'm sitting in the back. I don't know if you know what I mean by that. I know I'm not, because the steering wheel's there. But it's like sitting in the back seat and trying to drive. That's why I don't like it. I don't I don't like it. <laughs> Mummy, I don't like it. Yeah, it feels too much like sitting in the back seat. Love that corner as well. Hello, Nasty. How are you doing? Thank you for joining me, everyone. You're all lovely. You are all lovely. Feel free to say hello in the chat. I love having a chat. You're not just here to watch me play, because that would be boring, wouldn't it? We're all here to have a chat and a mess about. No console wars. No car wars, right? We don't want any, oh, this is shit. Project cars is so much. I don't know why I got that voice from. <laughs> it's all racing, isn't it? And I think, I think that, you know, most of us... Not all of us, right? but most of us will probably have more than one racing title. So, you can have this and Project Cars, can't you? I think a lot of it, like I always say, it depends on where your friends are. If your friends are all on Gran Turismo, the one you've got to get is Gran Turismo, isn't it? You know? Favourite supercar? What, in real life? In real life? Hasn't been a good racer since pole position, yeah. i tell you what though, now I'm playing this with a controller. It feels like the old Gran Turismo. It really does, actually. It really does feel like the old Gran Turismo. Racing against myself here and bloody losing. Yeah, you haven't got much finesse with a controller, though. That's the only problem. There's a lot of a lot of um, a lot of correcting. It's hard to master corners on the controller with the steering wheel. You put it there. You know, you put it there and you steer out the corner. With this, you're sort of like, oh, 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 am I there? Am I there? Oh, you are. You know, it's, it, it's, but it's still fun, and it suits this game as well. I will be playing um, Project Cars 2 with a controller as well. <laughs> that would be fun, wouldn't it? Hello, Andy. Hello, Puck. Did I say hello to you, Puck? Oh shit. Hate the way it does that. Give me some bloody, give me a clue, you know. Dirt Rally, yes, yes, nasty game, nasty. I've got Dirt Rally in VR, and I do stream it. Um, the only car I can tr control in Dirt Rally. Um, I'm not talking about the new one. I'm talking about, is it called Dirt Rally? Or it might be called Dirt. No, the new one's called Dirt, isn't it? Dirt Rally in VR. Um, the only car I can have fun in is the Mini, and the Mini is really cool. This is great munching on square crisps. Don't say square crisps. Are they salt and vinegar as well? Oh, you little shit. Is it, uh, it is easier to not use cockpit view, but I want to want a sim, so I'll use cockpit view no matter of hard or not. I just do. Yeah, of course. I play in VR. Of course I have that view in VR. Um, I don't know why. In 2D, it's just a view I've always had, you know? Got back before the server goes down for updates. Which server? Which server? <laughs> I just noticed it shows your steering position as a red dot on the dash you had. All oh, right, Red Wing, thank you very much, mate. Do you get speed ball on controller? No, no, no. 
Nah, that's the thing. You're missing out, aren't you? You're missing out, you know? <laughs> yeah, exactly, Eric. This bit hasn't got much finesse either, is it? In the actual game, I mean, the, the popping in and out. Thank you, CT. I'll tell you what, though, the thing... I mean, it's going over old news now, isn't it? Because we've all played it and we all know it. The fact that this is missing a career has upset me so much. I was really hoping... And it hasn't stopped me buying it, but... Oh, sorry. I was really, really hoping... <laughs> I'm starting in 20... Oh, were you in, Puck? Oh, awesome, mate. Oh, awesome. Did Schwing get in? The fact this hasn't got a single-player campaign has just so upset me so much. It really has. I really, really wanted um, to... I know I'm repeating myself. Is buy a little Volkswagen Golf, Passat, uh, fucking anything. Fit a K in an air filter, put the exhaust on there and build up, you know? Um... Yeah, exactly, John. It's upsetting, isn't it? Yeah. Now, John is. John just said he's not going to buy this for the lack of, lack of campaign, and it, it, that's right in a way. That's right. What is Gran Turismo without a single-player campaign? It's it's annoying, isn't it? What is it without it? You know. I will try and get to the. Um... Now they 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 call they've, it's got a campaign. It's not a campaign. It's just. It's the licenses, you know, it used to have li oh my good god, oh my good god, it used to have licenses, didn't it, to go on so you could open up different parts of the campaign. The licenses are there, <laughs> but there's no reason to do them. There's literally no reason, you know. So if the money isn't for campaign, what is it for? You can upgrade your car for online. Yeah, so these, the, when you pick a car, they're just standard cars off the shelf. You can build your own car, and as long as it stays within the realms of, like, um, you know, GR4, for example, or Sport, or GR1, as long as it stays within the realms there, you can modify your own car, um, you can put your own decals on it. So there is, there is a little bit. It's an online career, you know? So look, even, even Coda says he might not buy it because it hasn't got a single player. John with now says he might not buy it, you know? Yeah, I want it. This is the one I wanted. Because I'm fed up with the, with Project Cars 2 giving me an open game. I don't want an open game. You know, <laughs> it's just annoying, isn't it? Battlefield, COD, everything. They don't give you an open game. You've got to progress. And where's the fun in gaming? It's progressing and levelling up. Elite Dangerous doesn't give you every ship. You've got to bloody earn them, you know? So when Project Cars come along, Project Cars 1, and started talking about, oh no, we think the player should have access to everything. I was like, what? I want a campaign. Of course you want a campaign. But saying that, all of a sudden, this has made me start racing online. I'm quite enjoying it. It's, it's funky on a controller, though. It really is. Uh, and don't forget, yes, you have got the VR aspect coming. Now, PlayStation, it needs that. Yes, it is only one-on-one, -on -one, but the other night I was playing... Um, I streamed it as well. Please check it out, because I've watched my own stream back, and I really enjoyed it. <laughs> Not me rambling on. The racing. Oh, my God. Racing in VR. So I've got Project Cars 2 on the PC uh, with the Oculus Rift. Um... Now we was doing some racing and we got a few subs in but it was it was pretty quiet it was only about two or three of us so i ended up racing having a race with radar i think it was it might have been radar one on one and i tell you what i had the time of my life so the fact that um gran turismo has only got one on one i wouldn't let that i wouldn't let oh god he's pushing me from behind i wouldn't let that put you off the fact that it's got vr is amazing that's the that's the real key the fact that we've got a proper racer because you can't count drive club although it is okay it's a nice little test you know it's not it's not this so i'm really really excited about having vr on the playstation 4 uh, yes hazel i'm getting it i'm definitely getting it no no and that's why i can talk you know i can talk con constructively about it i think the very first stream i did i was drooling all over it and it felt good to be playing something called gran turismo again you know i love gran turismo with a passion it is literally one of the games that I love. Three or four streams later, I'm a bit like, well, okay, let's talk about it now. We, we can talk about it, can't we? I'm still buying it. I'm 100% buying it. It's a purchase for me. Today I'm trialling it on the controller, on the DualShock 4. It's alright. It's alright. 
So if you haven't got a steering wheel, I won't worry. You're not missing out. You're not missing out crazily. You are missing out, but and it is better on the on the steering wheel. There's just no doubt about it. But it's not terrible on the pad. It's totally fine. I am playing in auto purely because I just want to experience what it's like with a controller rather than fumbling around with gears. I can't even remember what gears the bloody the, the gear is, what button it is. Not interested. I just want to know what it's like to control and have fun with the game. So I'm I'm having a I'm having a day off. It's nice and easy. So forgive me for that, but I don't want to I don't want to be fumbling through the game. I want to play it like I used to. And uh, yeah, little secret. I always used to play an automatic on Gran Turismo One and Two. I'm so sorry. Demon said he's unsubbing to me. Oh, the right analog. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, cool. I'll tell you what I used to do um, in Gran Turismo. I used to have the right analog forward and backward for um, accelerate and brake. It was alright. It was good. I used to have that all the time. Now, don't forget, in, the, in this game, we have got the DR and the SR. I do like that. So, we've got the driver rating sportsmanship rating hopefully we're going to get um, ranked up with with other like-minded players that don't just uh, don't just come in here smashing about it seems easier in a way um i love driving in man yeah i know uh, trev yeah yeah definitely and i do on on the steering wheel it's just i'm just testing the controller today In a way, it's sort of, in a crazy way, it feels feels a bit easier on controller. I think it's just because it's so simplistic, you know? It is literally three buttons. Now, you know, your left and right analog is one thumb. One full finger on the accelerator, one thing, full finger on the brake. That's it. Now, I know it's the same as um, your steering wheel, but you're using your whole body, and it feels like you're using your whole senses. Here, I'm using three fingers. <laughs> you didn't think I'd say that today, did you? You know, I'm just using three fingers, that's it, rather than my whole body. <laughs> yeah, I know, Andy, I know, I know. Yes, you might be right, yeah. I'm enjoying it, though. I'm enjoying it. Too many gags, yeah, there was too many there, weren't there? I'm getting the poppers for three fingers. Oh fucking hell, Stuart. Look, all our new people are going to be thinking, what the fuck is this geezer? Thanks for coming in. Please leave me a little cheeky like. Um, I would love that. There's going to be loads more racing. Loads more racing on the channel. Racing is going to become, like Elite, Elite Dangerous, a staple part of the channel, 100%. I've been building up to it and hinting to it for ages. Um, I have got a racing rig, I do race in VR, I am getting Gran Turismo, I have got Project Cars 2 for the PC, um, got Ansetta for the PC, we'll be doing community races, we'll be doing the lot. I'm going to be pre-ordering this later on. I'll tell you what though, one thing I have noticed in this demo, everyone seems to really, really behave themselves. Now I don't know if it's this new idea um, of of sportsmanship rating and driver rating. Um, I've got two dislikes already, oh my god. Um, but yeah, everyone seems to be really behaving themselves. I haven't had any shit races where it's just like, oh, I need to quit because everyone's fucking about, you know? I mean, obviously you're going to get the, the odd bump. <laughs> like him. Come on, wait, I'm here, I've got the racing line here. Leave off, leave off. Oh god. Alright, take me. Take me, big boy. I love the history sections of the game. 
Well, yes I do, but why isn't it just car history? Why have we got Skype and all that sort of stuff? <laughs> you fell asleep <laughs> reading through that stuff. That was a really fun race. Where did, um, was Puck there? Was Puck there? Yeah, too much juice is bad for the steering wheel. Oh, disconnected. I'll tell you, you know what's going to happen now. They brought the servers down, didn't they? I bet you. Let's try this one. Oh, Suzuka. Did you watch Obsidian Ant stream? Yes, I did. Yes, yeah. Yeah, I was chatting to him. Well, briefly, because the chat was going mental. Because he gave me a little shout out in his last video, didn't he? I think um, something's gone wrong. They might have kicked the servers out. Let's have a look. No, it should be alright. Why was it not giving me any cars? Uh, thoughts on controller? Well, the steering wheel is obviously better, but this is this is fun, you know. This is fun. Today's the last day of the demo. Yes, it is, Trev. Yes, yeah. Start a room. Yeah, let's start a room. Let's start a room. Oh, I received a gift card. What we got? I hope it's a CV. CV two. See all this presentation of Gran Turismo. I like it. I, I like that little extra sprinkling it's got. You know. D leave off. Leave off. Can't do Suzuka unless you own a car. Okay, mate. Awesome. Thank you for that info. Yeah, I, I don't want that. I don't want that. That looks nice. That looks nice. Right, let's go to a lobby. Let's get you in. So, create a new room. <clears throat> so, if you are playing, lads, feel free to come in. So, we're going to create a room. We're going to call it GTUK. GTUK. Feel free to get your controllers, get your steering wheels, come in here. Race for fun. Yes, Hayes, you can, you, yeah, just two seconds and I'll set it up. Uh, race for fun. Let's have that. 16. Uh, we won't put any minimum on there. We will go to Dragon Trail Seaside. Get yourself in here. Come on, let's let's have a let's have a community race. Fine weather, cloudy, sunny. It literally makes no difference at all to that. Um, see, this is arcade, and it's slipstream strength strong. You know, I'll leave it on, but it, it's an arcade racer, isn't it? It's an arcade racer. There you go, lads and ladies, get in here. Oh, hello. So search for a room called GTUK. If you complete the shitty campaign mode, you get an awesome GT3. Awesome. Like I say, though, for all the slagging off, and um, I did a, I did a stream, I did a stream at ten o'clock, ten o'clock in the morning when the, when it was released. It's been a really, really bu busy stream. It's gone up to about 14k um, views now, which is fantastic for me. Only a tiny little channel. The amount of fanboy argument on there, like normally, um, I, I reply to every single comment on my channel. You look back on any any video, any oh swings in, awesome, and Hayes and Demon, awesome, and me, I'm here. Um, normally, I. Um, I comment on everything. I've given up on that video because you've just got the usual fanboys in. It's so annoying, so annoying. And they can't just, um, they can't just comment. They've got to get nasty. Not to me, to each other. Oh, and some of the things they've put in is absolutely physically disgusting, you know? It's crazy. Right, okay, well, we got us all in. Let's wait a couple of more minutes. <clears throat> Here we go. We're full. We are full. So we've got Demon in here, who's a lovely subscriber. Uh, we've got Schwing in here, who's a lovely subscriber. We've got Hayes. I'm guessing Hayes is subscribed. Um, I think that's all. What about Pug? Did Pug, Pug, Pug come in? Fanboy trolls, are I don't even... There's one comment that's got 44 replies, right? 
uh, have a look on it. It's <laughs> I, I put I, about 20 messages in. I just put, can you please take this elsewhere? They didn't listen. Then they're talking about dying and why don't you go and do this and why? Oh, it's just ridiculous, you know. I've given up now. I might even delete the first comment in which we'll just delete them all. <laughs> the graphics are brilliant. Yes, they are. Yeah. Right, should we start? Let me just see who that was. Hamburg, thank you very much for subbing, mate. Appreciate that. Okay, very confused here. I hear people not liking that there aren't campaigns, but see comments about winning prizes for completing campaign. Like, they call it an online campaign. So what they're taking, they're taking the element of campaign to mean that you can have true ownership over the car. So you can you can put the bits on it you want. You can decal it how you want. You can modify it, and that's the one you take as part of your campaign. My thought of a campaign is playing offline um, and progressing through some kind of campaign <laughs> yeah no you're right demon yeah right here we go let's go you have entered go to track exactly Chris yes that's not what they're calling a the campaign now hang on what car am I actually in oh this Peugeot thing okay Awesome, the Jeep. He says he's watching live. Thank you very much, mate. Well, I've got to get used to this car. This is... It's fast, but it's a bit slippery. <laughs> I heard there's two versions of this game. <laughs> you did hear that, didn't you? Oh. Now, remember on controller. <laughs> you, you lads. Love you, lads. Love it. Love our 10 a.m. streams every day, every single weekday. I stream at 10 o'clock in the morning, um, UK time. So every every single morning there's a stream, and we've got so many regulars in here. It's lovely, you know. Uh, I'm not a fan of this low view without any car. Yeah, I am though. I am because I struggle with. Oh yeah, this is the it, this is the other thing. There's a bit of a glitch on this car um, because there's no interior view. Yeah, there's no interior view. I, I battled with it for a little while, and uh, the fact that, yeah, the in-car view is more realistic. And it is probably better to watch. But look how much you're missing out. You've got all this peripheral vision, all these lovely graphics, and then you hide it. Oh, disconnected, charge the battery. It's fine. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Come on, charge, you fucker. Oh god, come on, why are you not why are you no charge? Oh god. Hang on. Here we go, that's it. It's totally fun on a controller though. I'm gonna play Project Cars 2 with a controller and just oh my god, I'm so sorry about that. Um, I'm going to play Project Cars 2 with a controller as well, just to see, just to see what it's like, because Gran Turismo seems to suit, um, it seems to suit it totally fine. This car is a bit of a handful, this Peugeot, it, oh my god, it really is a handful. Yeah, you're totally right, um, Mikhail, yeah. Now I'm in automatic of RGB just because I'm just playing about with the controller. Who am I talking to? Oh god, can you hear me then? Oh god. Can you hear me in the room? Sorry, I'm streaming. I do apologise. I don't know how to turn that off. Can you hear me in game then? <laughs> Someone just said, who are you talking to? Fucked up there, demon. <laughs> it might be full, Andy. It might be full, mate. Yeah, let me know in-game, in the chat. If you, can you hear me? Because I don't know how to turn that off. Can't change car. Oh, God. I had that the other day, Schwing. It would only let me do a rally car. No, I know... No, sorry, Mikel. I know you can hear me. In the in-game chat, they were saying, who are you talking to? Sorry, yeah. Oops. 
so sorry about that corner in this ultra bloody fast car. This is so controllable with a controller. I know I'm not bothering about gears, right? I know that. I know I'm dipping out there because I'm just testing the... Uh... Yeah, sorry, Shring. I don't know what, what happened there. I think it's down to what you got in your garage. I think I won something and got given this Peugeot. That's why. Mittal's got a Ford Focus. Yeah, I think it depends on what's in your garage for this race. We'll have another one in a minute and I'll set the car, see if I can actually set the, uh, the, the class of car. So we'll do this one because we've got a bit of... Uh... There's Hayes in front. Who did I just... Oh God. <laughs> Someone's crashing behind me. I'm driving... Hello Jess. I'm driving this Peugeot bloody thing. This concept car. It's alright actually, it's just that the brakes are not literally very good at all. So yeah, the purpose of today's stream, if you have just joined, I normally play on a racing rig with me Logitech steering wheel. Today I'm playing with a controller, just to see what Gran Turismo is like. For those that haven't got, or don't want, or are thinking of getting a, um, a steering wheel, I think it plays really, really well actually. It's just it's just not very precise. You're permanently you, Oh god here we go. You're permanently correcting yourself all the time because you has you haven't got that precision. Other than that, it is a lot of fun. And I think it suits this game, because this game, whether we argue about it or not, this is our, this is an arcade racer. This is an arcade racer. And I'm feeling like the old Gran Turismo's coming back, so I always used to play oh shit. I always used to play um Gran Turismo 1, 2, 4, 5, all with a controller, you know, I never had a steering wheel. Because I didn't have room, you know, and I thought, well, I'll quite enjoy it with a controller anyway. De it's definitely a purchase for me. I'm 100% buying this game, without a doubt. I like it. And uh, I'm interested in what they do with it. I'm, I'm looking for DLC for... And I don't even mind paying for it. I should, I should say that quietly, because I don't want Sony to hear. I want Trial Mountain. I want uh, Autumn Ring. I want all the classic tracks done. Nice graphics. I want to race them again, you know? All the nighttime tracks, all the Tokyos. I want them, you know? fun factor, I think I'm having more fun just sitting here at my comfortable seat, at the monitor, just playing with a controller. You know, for a proper session, of course, you want your steering wheel, but fun factor, I'm fucking loving this, absolutely loving it. So if you haven't got a steering wheel, don't think you're missing out at all. And you're going to get better at the steering wheel, I'm only permanently correcting because obviously I'm used to a steering wheel, but you, you're not, you're not going to miss out, you're not. It's all right. And you can certainly be competitive. You can definitely be competitive. There's no doubt about that. Oh, God, that was waiting for me then, wasn't it? Oh, I do apologise. I find that when you drive, it's either 100% steering um, or nothing. So, yes, yeah, that's, that's, yeah, there's not enough analogue. It doesn't, even though this is an analogue control, it doesn't feel like there's enough analogue. I'm sorry, guys, I was just caning it around there. I was thinking it would automatically start the race. I am sorry. Does track IR work with this? No, this is PlayStation, uh, Steve. Yeah, this is PlayStation. Anyone here who can play Forza with this game? Um, yeah, I've played Forza. Only the demo, so I can match them both up. I wonder if the demo is available. I'd like to play that again, actually. Um, it looks better than this. Forza is better looking than this. There's no doubt about that. Forza is better looking. Um, I love the fact that it's got different disciplines, like truck racing, but to me was oh my god talk about fun i love truck racing in forza because it had three 
had three sections to the demo. I really liked it. I'm, I'm still thinking of buying it, but how many racing titles do I need? Oh god, for some reason it's put me in this bloody car. That's not even fair, is it? I'll do a room in a second uh, where we can all join and I'll put... Um... Oh no, there is another Peugeot behind me. Let, let's race it out. Let's do it. Come on. Yeah, I'll do another room and I'll put the same classes together. I am battling with myself about buying uh, Forza. It certainly looks better than this, but I was playing it in 4K on the PC. Um, I like I like Forza. I like it. It was a good answer to Gran Turismo. Um, now, Project Cars Baby was Rain, wasn't it? And I was really interested to see what Forza did with Rain, because they've shied away from, from uh, Rain and Night Time so long, haven't they? And uh, their Rain on um, Nürburgring GP in the rain, oh my god, with the Nissan GTR. It was stunning. It was absolutely stunning. Um, <laughs> amazingly stunning. So they definitely took the rain and run with it. Ouch. No, I like Forza, and I think if um, you know, if you if you only own an Xbox or PC and you don't own a PlayStation, you're not missing out. Forza is an answer to this. It's certainly a really, really good answer. The motion controls. No, I haven't, Huck, but I certainly wouldn't be using that to steer. Absolutely not. No, yeah, absolutely not. Project Cars 2 Online is a nice and fun way to race casually. Isn't that against what it's for, though? Like, Project Cars 2 isn't really the... isn't badged as the casual one, is it? I think, if anything, surely this would be the one to race casually. This game is a total sim. You, you don't know what's good for you. Okay, oh god, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Put your seatbelts on. Gunhead's here. <laughs> Hello, Liquid. How are you? Right, let's see where I can do another another room on that track, because I do like that track. And I'll see where I can set... Um, <laughs> exactly, Samo, yeah. Um, I'll see if I can set it all up. Point of gears at the ready. <laughs> Second in a rally car. Nice one there, Schwing. See, all this sort of stuff, it's all about presentation, and, it, and that's what Gran Turismo does really, really well, actually. It does... I like that. I've missed that in a racing game for a while, is the sort of... Uh, you know, the presentation and the car porn. You know, like Gran Turismo 1, it was car porn. Even though when you look back, it was terrible graphics, it was mental. But it was it was car porn. It, it, delivered the, the, it delivered it to you in a certain way. And um, not many car games have done that. <clears throat> Just put on balance of performance. Let's, let's start a new race and see what, um, see what options we got. So let's start a new one. <clears throat> We're going to call it GT UK again. Because it's nice and easy for you to find. <laughs> right, race for fun. Oh, is this what you're talking about? No. Okay, race for fun. Uh, minimum driver rating. We'll still leave that. We'll still leave that. We go to the seaside. Fine weather. Number of laps. Let's let's put this. Let's go for a ten lapper. Right, we're going to have a proper one. Yes, Schwing, yeah, I didn't even notice that it was on, uh, it was on, I didn't even notice that it was on one lap, sorry about that. 96 laps, 200! <laughs> right, there's that, grid start. We'll have, let's have a rolling start, let's be different. Set by host, uh, uh, let's go slowest first, makes it more interesting. Boost? Oh yeah, because this is a real sim, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, this is a real sim. Should we have the boost? Oh, no, let's leave the boost off, right? Slipstream. Let's go wait. No, let's go real, right? Because this is a sim, isn't it? Uh, played a bit this last night. Something just doesn't feel right. Compared to Project Cars and Settled, the cars feel like tanks. So heavy and wallowy. Hmm. Make, make it five laps, because Swing's got to go. All right, I'll do that for a lovely subscriber and sponsor. So yes. Mechan mechanical damage. Let's have heavy, right? So if we all fuck up, you know? Tire wear? Yeah, let's have that. Mm, no, let's leave that like that, actually. <laughs> uh, right, here we go. Filter uh, regulations. I want to do the car type. Car, oh, car usage. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> Love you too, Schwing. Where is the cars to make it the same? Uh, okay. Finish my phone call. You can continue now. Right, let's get back on with it. 
Where can you set the car? The car um, class. Where? Come on, an easy thing. Where you can? Where can you set it? See, that's annoying straight away. Someone's going to tell me now. Someone, please tell me. I can't bloody see it. I can't see it. Car number type. No. Balance of performance. Yes. Where is it? Balance. Where is it, Jess? Where is it? <laughs> and Hugo's just put some expletives. <laughs> <laughs> Jess, where is it? Because I can't. A balance of performance. It's, it won't let me. Won't let me. Won't let me. Sorry, uh, dude. Or dudette. Power limit. Oh, okay. Uh, we can have a limit, can't we? Yeah, alright. Well, we'll go to. Left to that. Should we have 300 brake horsepower? Filter by category. Yeah, where is that then? No, it's greyed out. I think it's greyed out. I think it's... Oh, here we go. Yes, 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 yes. Gotcha. Oh, God, jeez, says Gunhead. Thank you, Lynx. Uh, behave yourself, uh, Gun. I can, I, can, I can feel the rage building in guns, can't you? I can feel it. Um, what should we go, GR4? Let's go GR4. How are the environments like? Do you mean like the... Uh... <laughs> what, do you mean the tracks? Here we go. Yeah, I can I can feel I can feel the rage building. I don't want that car. GR3 please. Oh god, I've <laughs> it's nice and warm in here, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, the 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 cut the tracks are always what Gran Turismo has done well. Nothing wrong with the tracks, totally fine. Yeah. I'll get him finally look, look, look. That sounds nice. Is there a change car? Because I'm in this bloody Peugeot again, and I don't want to. Yeah, no, I love it, Jess. No, I love it. I'm not. I'm not hating on anything. I'm not hating on anything. You don't get any hate here. Absolutely not. <laughs> Someone needs a cuddle. <laughs> Can I change my car? Why is it? I've put to 300 brake horsepower. Oh, God. When you set G, yeah, I can't do it from here though. Can I? Car settings, go to, I can't do it from here, can I? Oh, race settings, here we go. Edit event settings. And what did you want, GR? Oh, well, I have set it to GR4. What did someone want? Someone wanted... GR3. GR3, and then how, how can we make it so it has to be that? Yeah, I'll put it on GR3 for you in the Jeep, that's no problem. Balance of performance. Now, someone's telling me to put this on, aren't they? So we'll have it on. We'll have it on. I'm not sure what it does. Balls, I don't have a GR3. Well, shouldn't it, won't it just give you a car? Won't it just give you a car? Does it not work like that? What? Oh, come on. See, it's not intuitive, is it? I don't want to race in the Peugeot. Why is it not giving me another... It's not giving me another option, is it? No, you need to own cars. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's let's change it back then. Sorry to mess you around, everyone. Yeah, but where is the same class, Demon? Yeah, you're totally right. That's what I want to do. GR1. Alright, let's do GR1. Where's the same class? Power limit. Maximum tyre. Car number tyre. Car usage. Yeah, exactly, Demon. It's not there, is it? It should be like... I'm looking for the what they would call it. Yeah, how annoying. It's not there. It's not there. You should be able to put... Same, it's, come on, someone tell me. Right? Jess, tell me. You said you love it. Rolling star. There should be something to say. You know, everyone has the same car or the same class. How annoying. And I bet you it's going to put me in a bloody Peugeot, isn't it? Can't be the same cars because it's based on the garage. Okay. Looks like I'm in the fucking Peugeot then, doesn't it? Right, let's go to track. Which is where the career part comes in, doesn't it? You know, race setting, change car. Oh, okay. Change car, thank you, uh, RBT. It's in a different place. 
I haven't got anything. Oh, fuck's <laughs> sake. <laughs> alright, let's, uh, alright, that's fine. Let's go race setting. I'm so sorry. Did it, but I'm, I'm doing it, aren't I? This is, you're going to be doing this as well. So that's what we're doing. We're seeing how easy and hard it is. Let's go, um, what are the, are these slower ones or faster ones? I have no GR1 cars. Let's go GR4 then. fuck's sake <laughs> why can't you <laughs> you should be able to use just a standard thing shouldn't you I'm getting the arse now I thought I had a GR4 but obviously I haven't I haven't so what have I actually got what have I got oh what's this this is just anything isn't it this is use anything right we'll just put it on there Right, here we go. Just use anything you want, alright? I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna use the rally car. Well, which is GRB. Alright, so we've you're saying we've all got that, aren't you? Alright, let's change it to GRB then. Sorry, guys. Oh, for fuck's sake. Here we go. GRB. Boom. Yes. Yes. Change car, yes. Interesting, let's go. This is going to be a nightmare. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry Steve, I'm sorry. Right, we're all in the rally car. Oh, I'm getting, getting done from behind. We've all done exactly the same thing. Love it. Tell you what, let's just start it because um, Spring's got to go. Yes, yes, yeah, definitely, yeah. Right, final will begin. I'm just going to stay on the grass. No, I know, Steve. I like testing whether a game is intuitive, how easy it is to set up, you know? And sometimes it's just not, you know? Sometimes it is, sometimes it's like, where, why did you put the option there, you know? The change car option is a little bit weird. Thank you to everyone watching. Please leave me a little cheeky like. Hopefully I've got 70 likes. I mean, it's just a bit of fun, isn't it? Leave me a little cheeky like. If you want to come back um, and watch more racing, feel free to subscribe. I stream every single day, um, literally every day. Every weekday at 10 o'clock in the morning, UK time, I'm here. Um, at, thank you, Magic. Every Tuesday, Friday and Sunday... Um, in the evening UK time um, for a much longer stream so I stream every single day sometimes twice <coughs> thank you Trev and I normally play on the steering wheel and a racing rig on the green screen I just thought today I would just try the controller you know literally just try it <laughs> Mikhail <laughs> yeah he's, he's like now stop nagging him Sometimes you have to nag people for just the simplest things, and a like, to me, is the simplest thing. Oh, that was a nice move. Come on. Come on, lads. Keep up. I've put the slowest first, didn't I, Linus? I put the slowest of the slow people at the front. Which I thought was fair. It is a pretty game though, the car models are done perfectly, but like I said before, without repeating myself, I I haven't played a car game in years where the car models aren't right, because there's no excuse, is there? Car models are the easiest thing to get right for a, for a developer, because they're given all the dimensions, they, it's all lasers, all laser scanned, you know? I expect the cars to be right, and they are right in this, you know? No, it's during pole, no, I, I must have been the slowest then. Don't know, Najib, don't know. Yeah, don't know. Uh, love the way racing in lobbies feels altogether. Ghost in Trolls is awesome, makes me. Oh, Ghost in Trolls, yeah, yeah. Oh, 100%. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I like it like that. If you mess up, you end up ghosting, which I think that's right. I think that's a good move. I really do. Because how many times do you, if someone makes a mistake, they spin out, you crash into them. Yeah, I suppose it is more realistic. <laughs> no, I'm not showing off. 
the other actually that's not too bad spinning in front of you because you would actually in in the real race you'd be involved in that wouldn't you the worst one is when they spin off and come straight back onto the track it's totally unfair and uh, you are taken out by a bad driver so i like that i've got itchy nose <laughs> I like the driver rating and the sportsmanship rating. I'm well up for that. I'm up for keeping that nice and clean, you know? Thank you to Thomas. Thanks, mate. Oh, you got a cheap old wheel coming. Nice one. Oh, you. Yeah, so what game are you getting then, uh, Steve? Are you getting. Are you on PC? or Because we're going to we're gonna be having um, subscriber races, without a doubt. Without a doubt, we're going to be having lots of them. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes, yeah, yeah, definitely nil. Yeah, a little bit of ghosting, there's nothing wrong with that. And it, especially the first corner. The first corner is a killer, especially in something like Project Cars, where you genuinely do a bit of practice, a bit of warming up, a bit of qualifying, <laughs> and then the first corner is just a fuck fest. I hate it. And the amount of people that quit. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with ghosting. Nothing wrong with it. Thanks, Thomas. Oh, shit. Look at that. That that was nasty. Who was that? I'm gunning for them. There's Schwing. It wasn't Schwing. But the uh, collision model in this, right? And we can talk about it now. It's, it's rubbish. The collision model in Gran Turismo. But I suppose... Oh, we've put real damage on there. I'm all leaning over to the left. Oh, God. Hopefully, whoever that was that crashed into me is damaged as well. I like that in a race though, don't you? I like proper races where me mechanical damage is on, you know? Well, actually, Chris, didn't you say that, that you get a penalty for colliding in this? Didn't you say that? Yeah, I like that. It's all over to the left. I can feel it's really... it's fucked. Completely fucked. Absolutely fucked. Which is good. I like that. Okay, police sec tyres. Yeah, we'll have racing hard. Suspension. Oh, okay. All right. What's this then? Do not repair. Got no other option. Hmm. Oh, oh, okay. That's. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I like that. Yes, I like that. And the pit crew's pretty good. Very impressive. Yeah, I like that. Yes, tweet. It's very nice. Impressed with that. Hmm. Uh, the red lights, well, that's traction control, isn't it? And, and all the rest of it. ABS brakes. That was nice. And especially on a long... Um, I don't know whether you can do a mandatory pit. That would be interesting. Um, that was cool. I like that. Yeah, well done, Gran Turismo. Oh, there's Puck, look. Give me a little nudge from behind, he loves all that. You can't call it... Well, I don't know, Gary, it's prob... Well, you can, be yeah, no, I think you can, Gary, because I'll tell you what, apart from the fact that it hasn't got a campaign, which is killing my life at the moment, the sound is the same, the handling is very similar to other Gran Turismo's, the tie squeal is exactly the same as other Gran Turismo's, the collision box is exactly the same as other Gran Turismo's. There's no um, there's no damage in there or full damage like other Gran Turismo's. Actually, I think Jerry, without like I'm not hating on you, we're just chatting. I think this actually feels exactly like a Gran Turismo game. No, I, I really, I'm upset that it hasn't got a, um, yeah, I'm totally upset it hasn't got a proper campaign where you can grind it out and start off in your little, uh, oh, second-hand car, little Toyota Supra second-hand car, like we could in the first one. I'm, I'm gutted, I'm gutted, but I'm still, I'm still enjoying this game, I'm still liking it. I'm liking it a lot, actually. And I've had some good races in it, you know? We're not hating on you though, Jerry. That's not what my streams are about. We're just discussing. Shh. 
should it have ghosted there? Now I slowed down, and I know I was in I was in front of him at that point. Um, I'm not moaning about that geezer, but I was in front of him at that point, and the racing line was actually mine, and he ended up ghosting through me. I suppose the computer thought that I was um, messing about, so it, it, it ghosted me. Hmm. No, I think, um, Steve, I think he's saying there is no grind in this game, like there isn't in Project Cars 2. It's all open for you. That's, that's, I'll tell you why they've done that. Spoilt gamers, you know, that's what it is. You know, you don't want to, they, they don't want to grind anymore, you know. It's like kids don't want to chew food anymore. They want it all mashed up for them. <laughs> now, is this, now the, the real question, right, is, is this prologue? Are we going to get another Gran Turismo in a couple of years' time, or do you think that, for this generation at least, this is this is it? You know, there's a lot of people saying, don't worry, Gran Turismo, the proper seven, that's why it's called Gran Turismo Sport, because it's all about eSport and racing together. Is there... It, I tell you what, I fucking love this controller. Is there going to be another Gran Turismo on the way, you know, with, with the campaign? Are they just doing a cheeky Sony and selling the game to us twice? Smashing it through here, I tell you. Yes, I think so, Thomas. Yeah, I think this is it for this generation. I think I'm actually racing better with the controller, which is not not a good thing to say. Yeah, I totally love this game. Totally love it. Absolute purchase for me. It's got its it's got its flaws, um, but then Gran Turismo has always had its flaws. Always, even from the first one. Even from the first one, which blew my mind. The first one. I, oh my god! I'm off. No, I'm not. I've recovered. I'm recovered. Here we go. I'm off. I'm off. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, magic, honestly. VR. Have a look back on my channel. I think it was uh, two videos back. I did a Project Cars 2 stream um, in VR on the Oculus Rift. Oh my god, it is just. I think I had the most fun I've ever had racing. Racing in a Ferrari 488. Um, no, nah, there's always language on this one, Mikhail. Don't, don't, don't worry about that. Um, this is an adult stream, isn't it? Yeah, racing in VR and, uh, oh my God, smashing that car around the track. Now, as I said without repeating myself, there was only, there was only one other person in the room. Um, I think some people... It was, it was glitching out. Um... Yeah, it was glitching out, um, and it ended up just one on one. And I had an amazing race um, with one on one. So the fact that um, Gran Turismo is only going to have one on one VR mode that doesn't put me off. <clears throat> You're a nerd. Shut the fuck up. Who are you talking? Who are you talking to, Malty? Who the fuck are you talking to? Yeah, I know, I just ignore them. With games like this, you're going to get um, a few trolls in. Don't, don't even worry about that, I'm not worried. There's there's way more many nice people in here, you know? <laughs> but the thing is with trolls, right? What, like, what you must do with trolls is just ignore them and they go away, you know? Just literally ignore them. Try rally map. Oh, God, shall we? Shall we go rally? Swing, are you sticking around? Can we stay in this room, actually? We should be able to stay in here, shouldn't we? Yes, edit event settings, yes. This is going to hurt. I haven't done any rallying, any rallying at all. That's it. <laughs> 50, he's getting banned for that. He's definitely getting banned for 50. <laughs> If it said 45, maybe. 50? Jesus Christ. <laughs> 50. I don't mind him coming in saying I'm a nobody. But 50? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> no, I think he's talking about me, Tweet. He's talking about me. <laughs> oh, this is going to hurt so much. I haven't even raced this track. I don't know it. <laughs> No, he's talking about me, Tweet. Yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah. 
I'm 45, but um, yeah, what's that got to do with it? He'd be wanting my phone number next. Demon's in, nice one. Is it just me and Demon? Oh shit! See, you can't correct very well with a controller. When once you start steering the other way to correct, to correct, the game mechanics think you literally want to go that way, and it's not precise enough. I can't remember 45 or 46. Right, let's go. <coughs> Have to head. Yeah, no rush, wing. Yeah, see you later, mate. Thanks for joining me, though, everyone. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate it. Please leave me a little like. Feel free to subscribe. If your subs are public, your name, right, your name gets up on the screen, and I say thank you to you. Oh, yeah, we don't worry about kiddies, do we, you know? Kitty's coming in saying 50. I mean, seriously. Everyone didn't join. Oh, shit. Well, we'll have this one with Demon. It's, uh. You can tweak, tweak steering sensitivity. Okay, Jin. Disconnected. Alright. Exactly. That's what these little trolls, right? We're not talking about it, but just in general. They come in here and they say things like, you know. Oh, old geezer playing it. I was here at the fucking start of gaming, you know what I mean? And when I say the start, I mean, where's my, where is it, where's my PlayStation gone? I mean the start, you know, the paddles either side of the screen to my full setup racing rig with VR Oculus Rift. I've been there from start and it ain't finished. What, where's my PlayStation? I've got some funky music. Let's close it and start it again. Oh, did it freeze up for you as well, Hayes? Oh, okay. I think it is easier with a pad, Gary. Yeah, I think it is easier. It makes the game easier, which makes it more fun. Um, but you've got more realistic realism on the steering wheel. Yeah, I think you're totally right. Yeah. Exactly, we were playing the original GT, yeah, I was loving the original GT before, yeah, half of uh, the, the trolls that come in were born, literally, you know. It froze for you as well, okay. Right, let's go to, um, why has it got a 1 next to it? Does that mean there's 1 already open? Easier and faster with pad, yes, yeah, definitely. Right, let's create a room. How does Max feel about retro games? Totally loves it. Um, yeah, I've taught him to respect games. I know that sounds absolute bullshit, but I have. I've taught him to respect games for games and the history behind them. And not just like, oh, what's the new thing, you know? Of course he loves a bit of Call of Duty. He loves it, you know? Absolutely loves it. He, he loves, um, oh, shit. No, I'm showing my age now. Uh, oh, God. Overwatch. He loves Overwatch. Loves it. But he also loves other stuff as well, you know? Right, here we go. Uh, filter by category. Let's go GR, GRB. That'll do. It's called GT UK. Get yourself in here. Might have to pop GT1 tonight. Actually, look on my channel. I did um, a recent stream. Um, do it at night. It's not even that night time, though, is it? Yeah, I, used to, I did um, a couple of retro streams of Gran Turismo 1 recently, actually. Gary, um, I said this earlier, that's exactly what I did, was put the up and down as accelerate and brake. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Right, come on in, lads um, and ladies, come on in. Let's change car to the rally car. Right, search for the room if you are watching. GT UK, there's Pug. Demon, are you coming in? I remember typing in 16k code. Oh god, yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah. M millennials, which I hate that term anyway. Don't know uh, they got it good. I'm in awe of games and where they've gone. Yes, definitely. I was playing Elite Dangerous actually yesterday. I did a, um, I did another cockpit tour. Um, this time on the Type Six, and uh, I had to jump from such and such to Marope. Um, and I did it in VR because you know I never play that game in VR. I only play it in 2D because of the chat, you know. Um, it was just amazing. I was just like, oh god, you know. 
Yeah, Matty, Elite um, Elite in VR is awesome, yeah. Are you new in today, Matty, or do you know that I do Elite? I do. I mean, I am pretty much an Elite channel after time. Um, exactly, Liquid, yeah, yeah, definitely. Nothing, yeah, this is important, right? Nothing like doing the same race 50 times just to save up for one car for a particular race. You're totally right. In your vision, GT again. <laughs> Chucky Egg, I fucking love Chucky Egg. Absolutely loved it. Right, here we go. Let's get in here. Let's get in here. I'm having fun today. I hope you are too. Feel free to leave me a little like. Feel free to join in. Oh, new today. But in the, oh, you, you love my channel then. If you like a bit of Elite. Yeah. Well, I'll say you'll love it. You might not love it. <laughs> That's cool, Magic. Thank you. My streams are generally like friendly and interactive. That's what mine are, you know. But any hate just goes. Let's just start. We don't need to practice, do we? Let's start. Thank you, Tweet. Thank you. Right, five seconds. There we go. We're having a proper race now. We hate the hate. Yeah, we don't want that here. We don't want that here. That's, it's just not welcome. You know, it's just not welcome. Stella's dad. As Stella. <laughs> Enjoying your stream. Thank you, mate. That's it. Just had to break out a box of microwave chips. It's fucking 11 o'clock in the morning. What would you rather play? GT Sport or Project Cars 2? I still can't answer that. I still can't answer that. Project Cars 2 is a little bit unforgiving, but I like it for that. Um, in VR, Project Cars 2, any day. <laughs> Stuart, Stuart. Project Cars 2 in VR on the PC is amazing. But I think... Oh my god, this is going wrong. I think this is where Gran Turismo is going to start winning. When you get a few friends together, and when you start setting up your own lobbies, that's where, that's where fun comes in. But actually, is there much difference between... I know there's differences between Project Cars and Gran Turismo. We know that. But they're, they're mind you, aren't they? They're both awesome looking controllable racing game so I think I don't think either you know you're you're, you're not gonna have oh God. you're not gonna miss out if you've only got a PlayStation for example or you've only got Forza all of these all of this generation Forza Project Cars 2 Gran Turismo they're perfect you know But the more I play Gran Turismo, the more it's showing itself to be an absolute arcade blast. This is not sim. This is not sim. It is not. It shouldn't. And actually, haven't they taken their ultimate. Their, what did they used to call it? The ultimate driving simulator. That's gone, isn't it? This is a sim. This is an arcade racer. 100%. This is arcade through and through. There's nothing wrong with that, though. There's nothing wrong with that at all. It's an absolute fuck fest, isn't it? And where you're trying to permanently correct, it, it seems like the, the pad doesn't correct very well. You, you, you start to like, turn left and all of a sudden you are going left rather than just correcting the steering wheel. That's the limitation of the pad, I think. Oh shit. Yeah, you, you sort of... Um, you are sort of trying to do corrections that you would with a steering wheel, but you're not. You're doing full steers because you, because of full left and full right. Um, <laughs> learn the Scandinavian flick. <laughs> it sounds interesting. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Eric. Doesn't matter how you drive as long as you have fun. Oh, Georgia the jungle. Yeah, yeah. This race is almost 80% in ghost mode. <laughs> Yeah, it probably does, Gary. Yeah, I'm just trying it out of the box, to be honest with you. That was my little experiment, you know. <laughs> We're not doing that again. We're not doing that again. Stay in the room, everyone. Stay in the room. We'll change it to something else. Actually, the seaside track with um, rally cars was really good. You keep swinging from tree to tree. I've actually got loads of, of money. Two, two, 217,000. Um, fishtail, fish tail, isn't it, bruv? Right, let's go to... Let's change the track. All right, so we'll, we'll stick with the cars, because everyone's got them. And we'll go back to the seaside one. I like the seaside one. I really do. Um, fine weather. Number of laps. Let's do... Let's, do, let's have a 10-lapper, right? We're getting in here. 
10 lapper is there somewhere to say if you are watching is there somewhere to say you've got to have a mandatory man, 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 mandatory pit it should be shouldn't it does it project cars 2 is quite an easy yep one pit which I think makes the... Because now you've got to agree, haven't you? You know, you've got to uh, do a friendly agree, which I remember from... Uh, I remember, right, playing Project... Um, playing Grand Turismo 1 with my mate, old Brian. Um, yes, it might be fuel. Yeah, yeah, definitely. We used to take our little memory card slots around to each other's house on a Wednesday. He used to come around my house. I used to go around his house. Um, and we used to agree, you got to have one pit or you got to have two pits, you know? Yeah, Outrun was awesome, you know? Um, fuel, where's fuel? Because we can put the fuel really low and then we've got to keep um, initial fuel. Fuel depl depletion. Let's go 10 times max, right? So we're now, this is going to get interesting. This is going to get interesting. Mechan mechanical damage, we are going to have light, right? So we're going to have that. Tire wear is going to be five times. Mm, five times, twice. Let's go twice. This is going to be a good race, right? This is going to be a good race. So we've got a 10 lapper, we've got fuel is totally up, so it's going to deplete. Um, <laughs> my gosh, I'm so screwed. This is going to be awesome. Oh, I'll tell you what, um, Crazy Taxi, was. they should remake Crazy Taxi. I love Crazy Taxi. Yeah, love it. <clears throat> What's, why is it, why you know, why you know work? Oh, here we go. The initial fuel, how much fuel have we got? Oh, it's full, isn't it? Okay. Well, I've got it on 10 times depletion, so... Did you reactivate? No, I didn't, no. Yeah, look at the fuel going down already. Yeah, this is going to be cool, because we're going to have to fuel now. So we're just... Uh... I love the Dreamcast. The Dreamcast was an absolute awesome beast of a machine. That was just so let down by software. It's always the way, isn't it? Yeah, the fuel's going right down. This is going to be fun. This is the seaside, uh, just the standard seaside one, which actually, out of all of them, out of all the main tracks on the demo, this has been my favourite so far. It's a really nice little track, actually. And it's pretty good with these rally cars. I know they're totally um, misrepresented here, but it's all right. Right, let's start. Crash physics are terrible, aren't they? but I love it. I'm not knocking it, you know. The controllers, um, the controllers on the Dreamcast were just unbelievable, aren't they? Half a lap is about a quarter of your fuel tank. Oh shit! We're going to be lapping every. We're going to be pitting everyone. See, I can't wait to have proper community races. I've got, yeah, you know, I know a lot of you are new. Please join the community. But I've got such a great little community around Great Game Tech UK. Um, we can have some real, real good races. It's going to be awesome. So please feel free to subscribe and join in with that. We're going to be having lots of races. I'm just releasing a new website as well. Uh, and we can put details on there of lap times and people's liveries. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it's going to be cool. Ridge Racer was all right. It wasn't. It wasn't on my radar really. Not not the fact that Gran Turismo was out as well. Ridge Racer could just do one really, but it, it's all right. It, it was all right. I liked it on the PSP actually. This game feels a lot easier with a controller. That's that's the thing that's come out of this for me. It feels easier to plonk yourself exactly where you want yourself, you know. There's a new Road Rash uh, Magic. There's a new Road Rash out. I must uh, play that. She's in beta at the moment. Don't forget the fuel, lads. And we've got 10 laps of this. Right, there's Hayes. There's Hayes. Check him out. I 
I am having a lot of fun on this, I tell you. Carmageddon, oh god, the uh, gore in that was awesome, wasn't it? Just nick the racing line out off of Hayes. Half a tank, I could do one more lap, right? You're getting you're getting two laps out of a tank, so this is gonna be cool. This is exciting, I'm loving this. Thank you for joining me everyone. I'm having a proper blast playing the controller. I didn't think I'd enjoy it this much. I literally felt like that I would always I would be thinking, oh my god, oh on the outside. I really don't want to hit anyone. I like playing as clean as I possibly can. Um, I really thought I'd be like, nah, there's something missing now, nah, nah. It, there's not. It, it's fun with the controller. It definitely adds fun. How, um, oh, Jeff Crammond. Yeah, I remember that. Proper sim, wasn't it? Proper sim, that was. That was only on the PC, wasn't it? That wasn't on, that wasn't a console game, was it? Hayes has absolutely spanked me now. Hello, Mighty. How you doing? Yeah, I thought there would be uh, constantly uh, nagging in my mind that, oh god, this is nothing compared to the steering wheel, but I'm wrong. It's it's fun. Now, what Project Cars 2 would be like with its sim side with a controller, we're going to find out. We're going to find out. got to pit this time the only problem with that is we're all going to be pitting every two laps and so we can't choose a, a strategy as it were we're all going to be doing it but that's cool love that corner there this has got the feeling of an old Gran Turismo track in it Gran Turismo 1 or 2 track love this track this is definitely going to be a favorite I can't wait for the full version to come out so I can just spank it all day long Yeah, I got you, Jin. Slamming into it, huh? That's it. Actually, we'll go, let's go soft. Let's go super soft. Yeah, let's go super soft. There's no... Oh, yeah, it's refueling itself. It almost seems like there's an option to do it, but it's doing it automatically. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Virtual. You know it, don't you? You know it. He said he's going to spank it all day long. <laughs> Yes, sir, uh, Gary. I'm love this game. Love it. I, I mean, you can see when a game when a game makes you smile and have fun. Isn't that the job of it, you know? And I'm definitely having fun here. Right, I'm on super soft tyres. You don't want to be on hard, do we? Especially not if we're pitting every two every two laps. Super soft's totally fine. Oh, definitely gripping better around there. You better watch out, Hayes. I'm coming for you. Ah, this geezer here going really slow. He might have run out of fuel. They've run out of fuel. Yeah, they're going to have to limp it round. Yeah. Yeah, they forgot to fuel. Well, liquid, what can I say? I mean, it depends on your funds, doesn't it? You know, if you're a gamer, if you're a gamer, you're going to end up getting it, aren't you? and probably get Project Cars 2 as well, you know? And also, it depends on... Um, it depends on where your friends are, you know? But if you can only buy one game, then yes, you know. Are you dunking the bags? Yeah, I'm not dunking any bags today. <laughs> you have no friend. Well, you have now, Magic. You're part of the Game Tech UK community. You've got lots of friends, mate. Don't worry about that. Oh, look at me. Oh, here he goes. Hayes couldn't handle... Oh, he couldn't handle the pressure. He couldn't handle it. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Hayes is screaming at his screen. Uh, screaming at his screen right now. Absolutely screaming. Well, I'm not going to pick this one. I'll pick the next one. It's like having a Facebook friend. <laughs> Can't find uh, anything uh, but numbers when searching for the lobby. All right, who's that coming out? This is a lot of fun, I tell you. This really is fun. Good 
I'm feeling love for it. I think it's going to be one of them games that you just end up loving, you know. It's going to be your go-to racing game, I think. Project Cars 2 might be um, for the more serious racer. And if you want to get a few lads together that are clean racers and like a bit of tweaking, then yeah, Project Cars. But if you just want to race, look at the tracks. Look at it. It's just fun. Absolute fun. And it works. And, and the, the point of this stream was to answer the question, you know, does it run all right with a controller? Oh my god, yes. Yes, it does. Yeah, Rick, that's all good, mate. All good. Right, I've got a pit this time. I'm first at the moment. Demon is third. Come on, Demon, what's going on? The tweaking and twerking, you never get them mixed up. I'm disappointed in Demon. He's going to be screaming at his screen now, isn't he? Very disappointed in Demon. He's third. What's going on? No, I'm only playing. Don't forget to pit. See, that's arcade. The way that you're allowed to just like slam into the pit without even slowing down. Little bit, little bits like that give you a hint, don't they, of what what its mindset is? You know, this is an arcade racer, absolute mo arcade. A bit, 100 miles an hour, exactly. Do you watch any motorsports? I don't, Jim, to be honest with you. I've got no interest in Formula 1. Literally bores the tears off of me. Um, I don't mind a bit of... Um, <laughs> stay consistent. I don't mind a bit of touring car. I've watched that all day long. I like a bit of bikes, um, but not Formula 1. I don't know, Hugo. I don't know, mate. Maybe because I'm just a boss at setting things up, maybe. <laughs> Probably not. Right, I'm st oh, I'm second. Demon is first. Okay. All right, Demon. All right, you've answered the call. Who are you going to call? Oh, we've got the Celica. Is oh, no, that no, that's Hayes behind us. Oh, God, I'm getting stressed out here. Look, it's happening. It's happening. Demon is up my arse. Now, I didn't think that I would be saying that today. I don't even watch Top Gear, Steve, really, to be honest with you. I haven't watched a new one at all. I literally haven't watched it. Hayes is pushing his way through. Right, concentrate again. Here we go. Give him a bit of Gran Turismo uh, physics pushing up the arse there. Outbreak him on the corner. Yes, here we go. Here we go. I love this set of corners here. If you get them right, which is difficult on the controller, if you get them right, through there, through there, little tweak on the brake there, slow down, and then the same here. Oh my god, perfection. Look at that. And left haze in the dust. <laughs> Oh, he's got more power on me on the straight, and he, of course. Well, I'm going to have to out-circle him around this, around this bend. Here we go. Oh, oh, is that... I've got one more pit. Here we go. Oh, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. No, I'm going to change it up. I'm going to pit now, because then we're pitting on alternate at once. Yes, I'm pitting now. I know I know it's going to mess the mess it up a little bit, but I fit, I've got a plan here. I've got a plan. Yeah, I've got a plan here. Strategy. It's secret. No one's going to know. <laughs> Even though we're watching the stream. <laughs> yes, here we go. This is this is fun, isn't it? This is I'm I'm enjoying Gran Turismo today. Really, really enjoying it. I think I'm enjoying it more as well because I can get to the chat. You know, I'm all about the chat. Playing up here on the controller is uh, is cool. So now, yeah, I've put myself right behind. But I've also staggered it, so I may, um, I may have just messed it up. Yes, oh, VR does, yes, but it's it's a nice experience to share. It is nice to share.
Kane in this though, aren't I? Absolutely Kane in it. Right, who am I after here? So Demon is now first, the little shit. See you later, Liquid. Thanks for coming in, mate. Love this set of corners. It's really, really, really cool. Oh, no, 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 no. That's a shame. Shit. I do uh, Gremlin, but I don't like it. Yeah, I do, I do know about it. Oh, oh god. Now I'm steering all over to the left. Oh, because I put damage on. Shit. I'm going to have to pit again. I'm going to have to pit again. Oh, shall I? No, I'll try and do another lap. Literally, I've got my, my uh, controller over to the right now. Oh, Hayes is back in there. He's back. Oh, God, I've messed up, haven't I? I've messed up. I put, I put a weird weird strategy on there. Yeah, that was wrong. Oh, sorry. That was probably my fault. I'm literally holding the controller over to the right to try and keep this bad boy straight. Oh god, I've totally messed up here, look! Oh my god, no, I've messed up, and I. We're gonna. I hope you lads are sticking around because we're doing this again. We are doing this again. I was only gonna stream for an hour this. Oh, fucking hell! I was only gonna stream for an hour th uh, this morning because I've got some videos to make, but hey, when you. Oh, I'll tell you what's happened. I've only gone and hit the right side. It's straightened it up. I don't need the garage at all. <laughs> I don't need it at all. It's totally fine. Yeah, bloody controller. Yeah, it's totally fine now, look. <laughs> so when you next time you have a problem with your car, just hit the other side. It works perfectly. <laughs> oh my god, here we go. Well, I've definitely got a pit now. <laughs> It's going to make this set of corners very, very difficult. Lovely little set of corners, that is. I love that. <laughs> yeah, exactly, T. <laughs> yeah, I need to end on a high. <laughs> the way you just slam into the pit at 100 miles an hour is ridiculous, isn't it? <laughs> Thanks for joining me, everyone. If you have just joined, we're just having fun. We've set up a room. People are coming in. It's it's becoming epic, I tell you. It is becoming epic. Now, I'm third. Lazy's gone down to fourth. He's refueling. Okay. I love the pit crew. I like that. Yeah, I like that. That's, that's as good as it gets, really, isn't it? Um, the room's just GT UK, dead man. How you doing? <laughs> right, I'm third. Can can the strategy work? Can can anything change? Will anyone crash? Stick around to find out. I'm definitely after Demon. I just don't think it's going to happen. I could possibly get Haze, but we'll see. <laughs> Will anyone else crash you, mate? Yeah. <laughs> what a sweet little game, though. It is very, very fun. If you're looking for fun, go to Gran Turismo. You know, yeah. I think that's that's it, really. It, it's a lot of fun. It really, really is. And I tell you what, it feels like Gran Turismo as well. It really does. I thought that was... Uh... Oh, Hayes is in the pits. Hayes is in the pits, everyone. I think that's what that means. Yes, Hayes is in the pits. 
Now, what that means, I don't know. Can I? How far away am I from him? He's still in the pits. He's refueling. So's Pug. So's Hulky. He's still in the pits. Right, he's out the pits, and I'm on the straight. Okay, here we go. This could get exciting. That's Hayes up there. I'm coming for you, Hayes. And we've got last lap. Oh, my God. Here we go. Don't mess up, Hayes. Don't mess up, mate. No, no, no. Don't mess up, Jason. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Nicker gripping. I know. I know. Still out. Yes, we are, Scott. We're having a fucking great laugh here. I've got to get... I think Demon's won it. Demon has definitely won it. But I'm just so after Hayes, just so after him. I don't know if it's going to happen. I don't know. He's only there. He's only there. If he was any kind of subscriber, he'd let me win now, wouldn't he? I'm just joking. Don't let me win. You don't need to. I'm coming. Oh, I can get him down here. I can get him down here. I'm hoping that is Hayes, by the way. It's not Hayes. It's not even bloody Hayes. It's Hulky. It's not even Hayes. <laughs> yeah, you always let me win, you bloody liar, Scarab. We drew a rematch in VR. Oh, yes, we are in VR. Come on, get through here, Hulky. Come on. See what I mean, though? The terrible um, collision box is just so bad. But it's made me smile now for nearly two hours, so I'm letting it off. So I'm nowhere near getting haze, am I? Exactly, virulent. It's it's all arcade, isn't it? Absolute arcade racer. Now is that haze in front of me now? Oh my god! I've just oh, you know what I've done? Oh shit! You know what I've done? I will tell you what, I'm going back. <laughs> I'm going back. I've only gone and forgotten my fuel. <laughs> no fuel. That's it. I've run out of fuel. Look, I've run out of fuel. I'm going back. I was just so, I was so heading for Hayes. I was so heading for him. Oh my god! Don't mind me, right? I reckon I can still win this. <laughs> oh god! I'm surprised I'm not getting disqualified. I know it's the wrong way. I know I'm going to get some fuel. <laughs> it's the SRV all over again. Oh my god! <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. It, it's fine. It's fine. That one's fine. That's fine. Yes, at least I can pit. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. What's it doing? <laughs> One doesn't simply turn around. Oh, my. The pit's good, though, isn't it? Look at the pit. Look. Everyone's walking around. It's not perfect, but it's fine. <laughs> it's just... It's just plonked me all the way back through. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That is it. That is full speed. That is full speed. That was the slowest crash I ever saw. Oh, what am I going to do? <laughs> You're on final lap. No pits. It's Hayes. Look at him. Oh, look at him showing off. Look. Look at it. Look. He come first. What happened to Demon? What happened? we got to go again on this. we got to go again with the same. Would, can you just give me a little vote on the same everything? Just go again. Because that was funny. I love the fuel system there. I love it. He loved, Hayes loved it, awesome. This has got to go on your show reel. <laughs> oh my god, should we go again? Should we have one more? Yeah, let's have one more. Exactly the same, because that was fun. That was fun. Demon, are you up for it? Tell me if you're up for it. Of course he's up for it. Oh, that was funny. At least we know we, yeah, see I'm finding out this stuff for you. You can't go back to the pits. I just thought it'll be cheeky, wouldn't it, you know? That was a lot of fun. Right, let's stay in there. Everyone stay in. Right, let's go to the track. And we're just going to do it again, all right? We are going to do it again.
Jenny can't wait to join you guys in the lobby. Yeah, definitely. So if you are in, if you are interested in joining, um, shall I have one more? No, this is the last one actually because I've got some videos to make. I'm going on a holiday in a couple of weeks and I want to queue up some videos to come out. That was right. <laughs> You'd be going the wrong way with a controller. <laughs> Yeah, if you want to be part of uh, this little community that is growing, actually, be part of it. Press subscribe, and uh, yeah, it's going to be fun. Right, here we go. Here we go. This is proper. This is proper. Oh, look at him. Look. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, no, that's not fair. It's fine. Yeah, I think it was Demon. It's fine. Everyone's going to be fucking about to start with anyway. I can still, I can still win this, right? Ser I can still win this. I'm just following everyone now. It's fine. That one's fine. Oh god, people are leaving the room. You know it's bad then, didn't you? No, it wasn't demon. It wasn't. I was joking. So you can tell when you when you're making the game stretch its legs like this, right? It's uh, oh my god, it's awesome fun. But this is arcade racing. This is this is not sim racing, you know, which is totally fine. But it, you got to peg it exactly where it is. This is a this is an absolute blast arcade racer. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> I was just ca catching up then. Love this track though. It's one of my favourites, without a doubt. And it's got, it has certainly got a Gran Turismo feel to it, which is cool. Oh shit! You can still win. Of course I can, tweet. Of course I can. We've got pit strategies to work for now. We've got a ten lapper with pit strategy. This is awesome. And we thought you were getting better. It's fine. It was just the pressure for a minute. I am getting better. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. Thanks, Magic. Oh, now we're working our way up the field. Now we're doing it. Now we're... Now we're... Oh, God. We're, we're all doing it, though. <laughs> yes, Jeremy. Yeah, well, it's, uh, it's a room. Yeah, you can search for the room. GT UK, Jeremy. Yeah, it's all there. It's not private, yeah. I was playing a lot better than this, wasn't I? A lot oh no! I was playing pretty sweetly, and now it's all just got. I think the excitement has got to me. Yeah, I, yeah, I know, Mikael, I know. And I will do it one more time as well. It's because like now the pressure's on. That's what it is. Pressure. I want to get up the field. You know, that's what happens in racing, isn't it? You know, you end up missing your break points. You end up fucking up. You know. Missed it there again. Fuck you now. I think I had it right the first time, then I let off the brakes. Right, Hayes is first. He's a good racer, Hayes, as is Demon. The only problem is, though, this, this is the last race. This is the last race. Oh, dead man's in here. Nice one. Dead man's in here. I didn't notice he was in here. Cool. Oh, shit. Let's pit. Don't forget to pit. Don't forget to pit. Because I tell you what, they won't let you back in. Right, we're going down to Super Soft. Yeah, awesome magic. Yeah, do that. Oh, look. Different, different cameras. Look at that. This is cool. Yeah, I like that. Right, Pug. Haze is in the pits. Dead man's in the pits. 
this has been a lot of fun i've got to tell you i've got to tell you and i can't wait for the release of this i'll tell you what i might even play uh gran turismo up here on the controller you know just keep that as my controller game yeah it's a 2c that fuel tank there steve I might just keep Gran Turismo as my fun controller game up here, playing with you lads, get into the chat quicker, and keep Project Cars 2 on the steering wheel and the rig. Because I'm sure there'd be enough players that at any time of the day we could come on the stream and get a full room, it'd be awesome. Whose design is that? Lazy, what, what was you thinking? No, no, the assists are off, the assists are off. Sorry, Pug. Oh! That wasn't me, Pug. That wasn't me. That was lazy. There is something wrong with the pink cars. Oh, no! especially when it's got loads of stickers all over it and then oh the pressure got to him look here we go see you later lazy that's there to distract yeah definitely <laughs> i don't even know what that car is what was that car some kind of retro beast isn't it right we're not pitting this one is it a little aldi what I, d I still, I, d I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Does anyone know? Sorry, lazy. Sorry. That's the terrible hitbox within Gran Turismo. I can't believe it. Actually, they're handling the um, uh, the uh, hitbox is exactly the same as all the other Gran Turismos. It's terrible, really, isn't it? But I'm forgiving it because I like it. And I suppose theoretically, you're not always going to be smashing into each other, are you? You know, when you get a group here together, you're not always <laughs> crashing into each other, are you? I'll tell you what though, like I say, the idea of this little stream is just to try and see what this controller's like. <laughs> it's awesome! It is awesome, and it's nice and chilled out. I, I, I'm seriously considering keeping Gran Turismo to controller and just playing up here I can get to the chat like like you know I like to and keep Project Cars 2 for my sim um, and the steering wheel and all the rest of it you know that's how much I've enjoyed playing on controller today ouch Yeah, you're right, Jeremy, it does, yeah. Yes, it would be good if um, Project Cars had some kind of uh, demo, yeah, definitely. Oh, we're pitting, we're pitting. Right, so, Haze is in there, Lazy's in there, let's see what we can do. Yeah, definitely magic, yeah. yeah. There's a lot of holes in this game, a lot, you know, a lot, but it's also doing a lot of things right, you know, a lot of things right. Look at him taking pictures, I mean, this is pretty good, isn't it? Obviously, in the ideal world, um, you'd have Project Cars and Gran Turismo, wouldn't you, you know? I think Gran Turismo 100% has pegged itself as, as arcade in my mind, you know? This is fun. This, what we're doing now, just having a bit of fun with it, is what Gran Turismo is all about, I think. Demons first, little shit. Right, I'm going to play some seriousness now.
He's not bad, Lazy, you know. He, defend, he defends very well. Yes, miners. Yeah, 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 yeah. Send me a friend request, mate. Links in the description. No problem. Of course I am. My channel's all about community, mate. You know, all about people that want to join in and uh, be nice. Pressure's on on that corner. Look at that. I'm having a lovely race with Lazy. I don't know what the others are doing. Demon's still first. Hayes is second. I can outbreak Lazy a little bit on this corner. Right, we're not pitting this time. Yeah, Blockbusters used to rent you the game. Yeah, definitely. I don't even think Love Film do it anymore, do they? Or, or whatever they're called. Taking it wide there, taking it wide. Dead man seventh. I think dead <laughs> dead man's run out of fuel. Oh, dead man. Yeah, I can't catch him, can I? He's good. He is good. I tell you what, I love. They, they've left a little traditional Gran Turismo uh, sounds in. I like that. I like that. I'm glad they've done that. And I ain't talking about the tire squirrel. <laughs> I'm talking about the menu uh, buttons. Right, I can normally get him a little bit here as long as I get my, my breaking point right, which is about now. That's it. Mm, no. Well, maybe I caught him up a little bit. No, I haven't. Yes, I have a little. A touch. A touch. Wang is up in third. Right, they're in my sights. Come on, come on. I've got to pit this one. Oh, he's gone, he's gone up. He's taken Wang. He's taken Wang by the Wang. Oh, and we're pitting, we're pitting. Here we go. I love these silly variants that you can put in with like extra fuel and all that because it, it just makes for a more exciting fight an exciting race you know so using your wheel is a disadvantage i don't think so i don't think so what i like about the controller is i can sit up here and um i've got the chat right i love streaming where i can ha have instant interaction with you and we can all have a laugh together rather than oh i can't talk to you now because i'm racing and the laptop's over there you know so for that I think I think I'm going to keep Gran Turismo as a controller game. Sit up here, nice and uh, nice and easy for me. Doesn't take any setting up. I haven't got to get the rig out, um, and just keep the rig for Project Cars too. That's what I'm thinking of doing. I'm thinking of doing it. Oh, come on, out the fucking way! I think it might do. Uh, it might take a bit of time. Yeah, it might take time. Oh, where is he? I don't want to cut him up on this corner. He's gone. Where's he gone? Oh, he's there. Oh, he's lazy. Made a mistake. So did I. <laughs> oh dear. Hello, JD. Hello, Jamie. How you doing? We have been having a blast. I tell you. Oh, I've got a nice little corner coming up here. Yes, nice. I'm catching him. I'm catching him. Yes, I am. Gotcha. I've got you, Lazy. I have so got you. Yes, I've got you! Oh, 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> right, I can outbreak him here. I know I can. I can outbreak him. Oh shit! Oh. Unplayable? No, it's not, Jamie. Look, I'm having a fucking blast with it, mate. No, it's not unplayable. In what way? Tell me what way. Oh no, I've messed up now. I've messed up. Shit. Definitely messed up. All I can rely on now. Oh, Hayes is first, Demon's second. The pressure got to me. The pressure and reading the stream got to me. I'm hoping Lazy is in the stream somewhere. Obviously, he's not going to chat now. Hopefully, at the end of the game, um, he says hello. Um, hopefully, he is. I'm, ha I'm not having that at all, Jamie. Yeah, and I don't think anyone else has had that either. Maybe do a reinstall of it, but it's finished now anyway. Actually, hasn't it finished? I thought it was finishing at 12 o'clock um, UK time. It might be 2 o'clock. Oh, I messed up there, didn't I? Alright, oh, I'm oh, sorry to hear that, Jamie. If you like an arcade racer, mate, get it, because that's, that's what it is. It's not a sim, but it's a fucking good laugh, I tell you. De oh, poor old dead man. He's obviously run out of fuel, isn't he? He's obviously run out of fuel. You should have to somehow slow down. Uh, you know, you should have to. <coughs> A fake guy, eh? Was it, who, what from yesterday? Who's that then? Do you know a fake guy? <laughs> exactly, yeah. <laughs> it's finished. I want to race more when I get home. No, it, is, it has finished, yeah. Yeah, you got to keep an eye on that fuel, but that, that's the fun about setting up little variants on things like this, isn't it? I think you can only take a full tank. Yeah, I think you can. It's my last chance for the lazy. I can do this. I can do it. I might not be able to win, but I can get lazy. I promise you I can. I'm trying to take every bloody corner perfect as I possibly can. Yeah, but I'll be the best second you've ever seen. Now, nah, that's it. Awesome, Pug. Hold him back for me. Hold him back. <laughs> Hold him back. Oh, yeah. Come on, baby. Oh, no, no, Pug. No, Pug. No, no, Pug. No, Pug. Oh, fuck, Pug. Oh, come on. But it's fine. It's fine. The race is still on. The race is still on. <laughs> oh my god, I've never had so much fun racing, I tell you. That was awesome. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Yes, come on, I definitely want this lazy. I definitely... <laughs> Fucking hell. Hello Smurfin, how you doing? I can do this, I can get lazy, I swear to you I can. That's it. Right, here we go. He's a good racer. He is good. He is good. Exactly, Tweet. This is 100% fun. You want fun, come to Gran Turismo, right? 100%. Hayes is still first. I hope, hopefully Hayes stick around, sticks around the channel. Because he's a good racer! And I've just fucked it. I've fucked it. All I can hope is for a mistake now. All I can hope. 
Can you do a Murray Walker? <laughs> no, I can't actually. No, no. Oh, now I'm going to the left as well. You know what? You know what I'm going to have to do. Hit the right hand side of the car to straighten her up. Oh, that's a shame. Anti climax. Anti climax. That is because now I can't. I can't do shit now. You know. Yeah, no worries, uh, Trev. Thanks very much, mate. This is the last one anyway, so please leave me a little like on this. Uh, we've had a lot of fun today, and I hope you have as well. Um, and feel free to subscribe. Let's get a sub train going. I can't believe you're all subscribers. Hit that sub button and come back and see me again. Yeah, I'm playing with the controllers today. That's what it's about today. Just trying out the controller and seeing what this game is like. If you haven't got, or you haven't got room, or you don't even want a, a steering wheel. And I tell you what, it's fun. It's fun. That is it, everyone. Hayes is it. Thank you, Hayes. That you was bloody good racer. And Demon's good as well. Look at that. Oh, Hayes won. Look. Look. Uh, by, a, by a mile as well. Awesome. Thank you for... Uh, had to, oh, God. Pug had to answer the door. Couldn't you have answered the door before? <laughs> that is it, everyone. Unfortunately, Trump here for video over. Yeah, I know, Trev. But absolute purchase and i will see you all on release day with this uh, and that's it everyone um i will see you again tomorrow morning at 10 o'clock see you later everyone